Hey, what's up everyone? Glock9 here and welcome back to Lucky Looter. It is the morning of day four. I do have a couple of skill points to spend here this morning. Now, I would like to continue pumping Daring Adventurer. To do that, we need to get Intellect to level four. I also want to keep pumping Better Barter. To do that, we need to get Intellect to level three. So I'm going to put both of these points into Intellect. All right, let's roll. We got to wait for Joel to open up so we can take another job. We also need to find a place to hold down the horde, which, uh, look at this. We got a little catwalk right there. And we didn't even have to build it. This could be the place right here. And it's conveniently located right next door to our house. Double pocket mods, so oh, I'd love to craft some of those, but we can't. Also, this lucky looter book, Find More Lead in Loot. I said I was going to sell that. Well, I'm going to read it. I figure, what the hell? It is a Lucky Looter series. We might as well read all the Lucky Looter books. Now, look at this. This is all set up already. The zombies can find their way up here. Right up to the catwalk. Let's see what we got in here. Uh, take the stone, get the clay out of there. Let's get the trash out of here as well. Uh, it's probably a bird up here. Let's see what we got in this box. I'll take the repair kit. No need for that battery. Let's see if we do have a bird before I start making a bunch of noise. Yep. Come on. All right. So, this could work out even if we don't find a hammer or a stone axe. We just got to knock a couple of blocks out here. This one and this one. All right. Now we just put in a couple of frames. And then we shoot at the zombies as they're coming up to the catwalk, shoot them while they're on the catwalk, and when they get too close, we pull up the frames and then rinse and repeat. We could build something right here also for more protection, but if we can't upgrade the blocks with a hammer or a stone axe, what's the point? But I still think that could work, like I said, even without being able to upgrade blocks. It'll just be a little bit more dicey. Now, this drops down into this place, so what we could do here is put in a ladder but just leave out a couple of ladders at the bottom. And this way, if that other area fails, we could put in those extra two pieces of the ladder and we can fight them on the roof while they're trying to come up the ladder. We can put some blocks there to prevent them from getting up or whatever. It could work. It's going to be a bit of a scramble, but it's only the Night 5 horde, so I'm not too worried about it. Lead. Nope. Uh, don't need that. Nope. The, take the cat food. Good on the other two things. And I'll scrap that one nail. Okay, uh, I think that's it. Mm, backpack. Uh, scrap that and take that. And no need for that stone sledgehammer. We got a better one than that. A little bit more iron. Zombie. How you doing, lady? Got a crawler. Let's take care of him. Let's see what we got in the laundry room. Uh, that sells, the puffer coat. I'm not going to wear it because we got the letter jacket. The college jacket, whatever you want to call it. And that gives us a stamina boost. I'd much rather that. Uh, the lead trophies sell for a decent amount. I'm not going to take this apart. I know I can get forged iron from that, but I don't really care. Let's pop the door open. If we're going to use that, uh, if we're going to use that ladder idea as a as a backup, we might as well give the zombies a way into this place, an easy way in anyway. Scrap the brass. See what we got in here. Another zombie. Come on out of there. Pop. Ready for number two? Pop. And he's dead. Murky water. Oh, take that. Sell that. Uh, Joel's inventory restocks today, so that's good. Uh, oh, um, do I need this? I don't need it. It doesn't sell for much. I guess I'll just scrap it for the iron. Paper? No. Alright, let's just finish up here so we can go see Joel. Oh, 
two birds with one motherfucking sledgehammer. Some medical supplies right here. Nope. Beer? I'll sell it. Kind of useless until we can find that book that prevents blurry vision. Nope. 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 There we go. Some shotgun shells. Take the iron. Some ammo. Sell that. And... Arrow rest mod. Uh... What does it sell for? 61 bucks? Yeah. I'll probably just sell that. Okay. Take that. More food. That's good. Last jar. Iron. Iron. And that's pretty much it. Another glass jar. Okay. Let's, uh, let's go put that ladder in before we leave. And then this place will pretty much be ready for the horde unless we find a stone axe or a hammer. Then we're going to want to do a little bit more work here. We might as well, right? If we have the ability to upgrade blocks, then we'll get a little bit more work done here tomorrow before the horde starts. If we don't end up finding one, then this is pretty much all the work we can do. Hi, right, Candy. I'll take that. The jailbreakers could come in handy. Ah, sugar butts. Definitely need that. I'm not too worried about the jailbreakers and the safes we haven't gotten in yet. The longer it takes for us to get to those safes, the better the loot will be inside. I mean, that's the theory anyway. Eh, I'll just sell that to him. I don't care about repairing it first. And the brass. And that's it. Let's see what we got here. Blade traps. Look, we could start collecting traps, but we got better things we can spend our money on now. If he's got it, anyway. Here we go. I'll buy all that. Take those grenades. Uh, I should... Probably buy those steel arrows, but I'm going to save my money. Gratitude. We'll take a trip up to the other Joel's tomorrow and see what he has. Uh, buried supplies, but it's a tier two, so there's not going to be any food in there. Probably just a couple of bullshit pieces of armor, so I'm not going to bother doing that. Plus, we still have a stone shovel. Let's do this fetch quest. I'll be back, buddy. Well, here we are. Doesn't look familiar. See what we got in the mailbox. Double pocket mods. Yeah, I'll sell that again. Why not? Let's fire up the job and double loot that mailbox like the exploiting son of a bitch I am. Double pocket mods. Yeah, I'll sell that thing again. Why not? <laughs> well, it's Groundhog's Day. Again. Uh, well, there was a bird nest over here. Must have disappeared when I fired the job up. Oh, hey, buddy. Here's your wake-up call. Oh, I think I woke up everybody in the house. That's all right. It's bound to happen sooner or later. Timing here is going to be a little different. Oh, still got her with a knee shot. I never played open smash shut with a garage door before. All right, uh, back door's locked. Some ammo, it's nice. Job's done. Let's see what else we can find here and then we'll go do another one. Hey, another wrench. Got a backup or we can just sell that one. Don't need a second wrench to craft a workbench because we can't craft anything. Which I tell you is kind of load off my mind, you know? It's definitely challenging, obviously, but it's kind of nice not having to worry about it. Oh, there we go. That's sweet. Way better than this uh, pipe pistol bullshit. Let me uh, go modify here to pull the bullets out of that. We'll sell that thing too. 
No zombies in there, but they're somewhere. In that room, I guess. There's a bird now, too. Somewhere. Oh, this is a box. Three nails. Now let's see what we got in here. Just uh, the one lady, it looks like. And she dead. Cloth, no. What? Oh, that's a another key. Okay. Uh, there we go. Nope. Nope. Yep. I'll take that. I'll take that. All right. Nope, don't need a flannel. Don't need another pair of boots. Oh, duh, that's where the key was. Um, guess we got a zombie on the other side of this wall. Let's, uh, pop it open. And deal with it. Skinny Pete! Oh, get this plan out of the way. Down he goes. Alright, I guess we have to go outside and then we go back into that room where Skinny Pete was. Where's this bird? Right there. Oh, there's another one. Let's just get inside. Oh, it's pushing me. Oh, shit. Damn it. Fuck off, bird. I had, like, nowhere to run. <laughs> like this little room with spikes and a zombie. Takes care of the abrasion. Bathroom. Murky water. That's it. Red rum. I like spiced rum. I don't know about red rum. Military armor parts. We'll sell those. I don't need the clay soil. I'll use that. I'll take this padded leg armor. Sell that. Um, I don't know what this flashlight is pointing at. Is that it? Maybe there's uh, something up on the roof? Zombie. Couple zombies. I don't see any loot, though. Alright, whatever. The zombies now are chasing me off the roof. Screw them. I saw some farm plots up there. Apparently we can use farm plots that are already existing in the world to plant crops if we want to. The thing is... We can't convert the crops into seeds, because we can't craft seeds. So we'd, we'd just be reliant on finding um, finding the seeds in the world. Now, I know there are farm bundles you can get, usually from supply drops, but I have supply drops turned off. Uh, how much do these even sell for? Four bucks? Get out of here. What you got for me, Joel? Oh, level 3 fire axe or a level 2 iron crossbow. I would like the fire axe, but I think we should take the crossbow. More weapons, the better, right? Um, Let's... That's kind of close to home. Let's do this one. Yeah, it's a little bit further away. We can check out some different areas we haven't been to yet. Oh, I forgot to sell them all this shit. My short-term memory is fried. Hey, Joel, I forgot to sell you all this stuff. Not gonna say anything? I don't blame you. Look at what we have here. A little garden with some corn. Let's take it. And it looks like this is the house where the job is. So once we fire up the job, this should all respawn. And then we can get more corn. And we gotta eat it raw because we can't cook it, but... That's fine. I'll eat it raw. Out of my way, signs. Fire this up. And it's all back. Let's go get some more. Oh, I didn't even see the potatoes. Oh. Just one potato. Not a big deal. Matter of fact, I'll eat that one potato. No sense in... Keeping that in our inventory. Nom nom nom. Think this floor is gonna give out? 
Yep. So technically we're supposed to start in the basement then, because we're supposed to fall down there, but I'm not going to do that. I'm going to pop this open. And we're just going to jump over here. And then we'll go down in the basement when we're ready. I'm not going to be forced to go down there. Yucca juice. Uh, yeah, we're thirsty. Let's take this radiator apart. I should be doing this, keeping my eye out for radiators. I'm, I'm sure I've walked past a bunch of them in the last house. Just like I walked past the main loot, I'm sure. There wasn't any main loot. I definitely missed it. Mm, shit. <laughs> Just like I missed that lady. Oh, you weren't fast enough, Pete. Holy shit. I took that like a champ. Let's see if we can do it again. Nope. Nothing. Safe. Okay. Let's take this radiator apart. And uh, I'll just beat into that safe. Some shotgun shells and a level 4 pipe shotgun. Certainly not the best shotgun. Arguably not even worth using, but we're going to put a round in it anyway. Could come in use as like an emergency or... Uh, it's good to just like soften up zombies and sometimes you can get a one-shot kill with it. Paper, sand, and that's it. Sand. Scrap that grill. Scrap that grill. Take that water. Bone. No. Another wrench. Okay. Probably just sell that. There's a pipe. Let's use that to repair the shotgun. A couple of coffees. Whoop. Thick trying to sneak up on me. You were close, buddy. But unfortunately, close only counts in horseshoes and hand grenades. Which is a saying that y y your grandfather would say. And you would think he was losing his fucking mind because it's so random. You know? You'd be doing something with him. And you'd be like, oh, that was close, Grandpa. And he'd be like, fucking horseshoes and hand grenades. And you'd be like, well, Grandpa's got Alzheimer's now. Oh, see, it knocks him down. Softens him up real nice. You gonna come up the stairs? No, you gonna stay right there? That's actually better for me. Damn. What's up with Skinny Pete being able to take a wallabing lately? I need to be stronger. That's the problem. Uh, my character is usually much stronger by now. But we've been going into, you know... Daring Adventurer, and Lucky Looter, and Better Barter, which are perks we should be pumping up, you know? it's it, You gotta play different every now and again. Um, but, but yes, I, I'd like to get at least one more point into Daring Adventurer, and then we probably should spend uh, a few points pumping up strength. I'm gonna take that steel and hang on to it. I sold some steel early on, maybe like day one or day two. Um... We definitely should be hanging on to it from here on out, because we can use it to upgrade blocks. Okay, um, we're gonna replace our fire axe with the level three. There we go. Whoop. Uh, take that stuff. And we already searched that box. Okay. We gotta get upstairs. That's where the supplies are, and that's where the main loot is also. Wow, what an obnoxious waste of time. Fucking mufflers. Nothing. Nothing. Good on that hoodie. Let's take this apart. Get up in the attic. Get the loot. Get the hell out of here. And then uh, maybe we'll do that restore power job. That could be fun. Keep us working through the night. 
Um, we got a couple of skill points here. Now, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna kind of do both. I'm gonna do better barter, level two, and instead of daring adventurer, which we have to n put another point into intellect for, I'm gonna throw a point into strength, because, you know, when you're not even knocking skinny Pete down with the sledgehammer, you gotta get stronger. Oh boy. There we go. There we go, popping heads, baby. Back the fuck up. Uh-oh. We got zombies at the hatch. How many are down there? Let's try, uh, open smash shut with the hatch. Oh, didn't work. Oh, shit. How many were down there? Son of a bitch. Oh, God. Okay. Not good. Well, at least we had this pistol. We would have been in big trouble if I didn't, because it's quick to reload, and it does decent damage. A machine gun, that pipe machine gun just takes too long to reload. And if we would have had that pipe pistol instead of this pistol, oh man, we would have been in trouble. Let's go ahead and eat the eye candy now. And we can put that muffler mod on our leg armor. I'm just realizing we don't have any pants on. <laughs> I skipped over pants earlier. I'm like, pants? I don't need pants. I needed pants. <laughs> oh, okay, so... Gotta keep a lookout for pants. Oh, nice. I'm eating the blueberry pine now. Because we are hungry. Forged iron, uh, that has a sell price. We'll just sell it because we can't use that for anything. We'll repair these uh, knuckles and we'll sell those. And if we can get a pipe, I uh, can't get it from the bed, I don't think. Um, we just go back to the kitchen, get a pipe from the sink, repair this uh, level three pipe shotgun we picked up, and we'll sell that too. Hey, Joel. Greetings. You've made my day. Wooden bow. Here is your Leg armor. Uh, I'm gonna go wooden bow. Just like I said earlier with the crossbow. More weapons, the better. It's a little far away, but I'm doing it. Just the task. We'll stop home, drop some stuff off, and we'll head in that direction. Now, I got a couple of more skill points to spend here. We can either get Skull Crusher to level 2 by putting a point into Strength first, or we can get Daring Adventurer to level 2 by putting a point into Intellect first. I think we go Daring Adventurer. Alright, I gotta stop. We gotta get this marked on the map. I don't know what the hell that is. It looks like a giant castle. Um, I'm just gonna put a marker right around here. Call it Castle, and we'll come back another day. Check that place out. Well, we found the snow biome. Can I get another egg? Yes. We're pretty full. Been eating eggs the whole way. Nothing there. Oh, we're going to start freezing soon. Because, uh, you know, I don't have any pants on, and we're in the snow biome now. But hey, at least the loot will be better here. Motor tool parts, and I got to go. Okay. Come here, chicken. Where'd you go, you son of a bitch? Oh my god, that's a mountain lion. See you later. Fucking chicken. I think that was like a shot in the dark. I just swung the hammer and I hoped it would find the chicken. It didn't. Alright, here we are. Maggie's place with the auto shop connected to it. Maybe we can find a hammer in there. Been saying that for... Four days now. We still haven't found one. Alright, this, uh... Shouldn't be too bad. Hey, there's Mo. Get some sneak damage, finally. Oh, how I've missed that. Coffee. I'm gonna drink that shit right now. Let's clear this bathroom. Okay. Paper, no. Let's try and get through this quickly if we can. 
Oh, a stripper in the kitchen. I hope you washed your hands before you touched any food. Oh, and they're out. And they're both on the floor. <laughs> Skinny Pete's dead. Your turn, lady. Hop up here. Boop. Okay. Going good so far. Let's clear this kitchen, get up on the rooftop. That's where the uh, one of the generators should be. And that's an easy one. Because once you clear the roof, um, I don't think there's a way for zombies to get up there. But the generator in the auto shop, that could uh, stir up some problems. All right. Uh, let's go. Wood? Nope. Don't need any wood. Here's the first generator. Egg. Bird. Oh, swing and a miss. Gotcha that time. All right, let's clear this roof before I turn that generator on. A couple zombies up here. Uh, the other one is still sleeping. Ooh, he dead. Get some sneak damage in here. Bullseye. There we go. First generator is fired up. Now we can drop down into the uh, auto shop here. Magnum ammo, and I'll scrap those nails. Here we go. Get back down there. <laughs> mm, boop. Dead. Let's go, mechanic number two. Dead. Beautiful. Just hoping for a hammer. Let's take this apart, see if we can get an engine. Nope. Come on, just give me a fucking hammer. We got a toolbox down here. Another wrench. Some gas. All right, well, you know, it's going to be just... That's the challenge. We're going to fight our first horde without the ability to upgrade anything. That's a, There's a challenge for you. So it's a challenge within a challenge. Yes. Yes, more zombies. Ooh, that was nice. But this is gonna get out of control quick. There's a fucking wolf at the back door here. Oh, this is not good. Oh, this is really not good. Shit. Oh my god. Oh god, die wolf. Die wolf. And they can get up here. Fuck. Oh god. Oh, I can't make that jump. We should put points into parkour. Mental note. Parkour. Get up here. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. No. Fuck off. Kill the wolf. Kill that goddamn wolf. God. I need an extended magazine on this thing. Okay. Wolf is dead. All right. That's a little weight off my mind. I just gotta kill these bricks. Oh, fuck you, lumberjack. Nope, that's not what I wanted to do. Use a bandage. All right. Oh, God. No. 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 Use another bandage. Get up here. Reload. Reload. Using more ammo than I would have liked to, but better than dying. Jeez, what a mess. Haven't even fired up the generator yet. Using bullets on a crawler. That's how desperate I am right now. Dead. Mm, dead. Holy shit. No, that guy's not dead. Mm, still not dead. Now he's dead. Oh, come on, generator. At least with this thing fired up, if we need to make a uh, a quick getaway, we can. And the job 
will be done. Okay, job's done. I definitely do not want to leave without this loot, though. Splint. I don't really need that. Actually, I do need that. I forgot. I can't craft one of those if I need it, so... It would definitely be good to have one of those at home in the event, uh, the likely event, that I break my leg at some point. Okay, what do we got up here? Some trash? Nope. I am just in full panic mode right now. <laughs> I just want to get the hell out of here. Take that. Got some books. Nope, just paper. Just some paper. I'll take the leather. Might as well. Nothing there. Okay. I think we got everything. You know, there is a back area. And there's some cars out there, but... There's also a, a dog or two out there. Let's pop these open. Just in case. We need to run this way. Yeah, we got some full cars out here that I would love to search. I don't see the dog. There it is! Mmm, one down. And here comes the second one. Okay. Search these cars and... Go home. Springs. Radiators. And some other shit that's not a hammer. Fuck you, lumberjack. I'm going. I'm done. We made it. Almost didn't. It was close. But hey. Close only matters in motherfucking horseshoes and hand grenades, bitch. <laughs>